interesting exponential equation today, 2 to the power x equal to x to the power 32. How can you solve it? In this video, I'm going to fully explain you how can you do this step by step. First of all, well, let's rewrite our challenge. So we have we have 2 to the power x equal to x to the power 32. So here's our challenge. And right now let's raise both sides to the power 1 over 32x. Okay, so we, we just raise in both sides, so left hand side and right hand side to the power 1 over 32, 1 over 32x. Okay, this is a really great, great trick. So left hand side, so we have, what do we have right here? We have 2 to the power x raise to the power 1 over 32x. And we have the same thing on the right hand side, equal to x to the power 32, and we raise all of these to the power 1 over 32x. Okay, everyone know about a really great property, so if we have a to the power x raised to the power y, we can write it as a to the power x times y. So in, in other words, we just multiply our we just multiply our powers. So let's do the same thing right here. So we have we have on the left hand side we have 2 to the power x times 1 over 32x, 32x, and on the right hand side we have x to the power 32 times 1 over 32x. Right now, let's look closely what do we have right here uh, with, with the powers, okay? So we have on the left hand side, we have x in our numerator and in our denominator. So we can easily cancel our x on the left hand side. And on the right hand side, we can easily cancel this 32. So as a result, what do we have right now? We have, we have 2 to the power 1 over 32. Yeah, 2 to the power 1 over 32 equal to x to the power, x to the power 1 over x, 1 over 1 over 1 over x. Okay, it was our first step. We just simplify this a little bit. Right now, let's change an order a little bit. So let's change position because we prefer our x on the left hand side. Okay, so we have we have x to the power 1 over x equal to 2 to the power 1 over 30, 1 over 32. Okay, what are we going to do right now? Uh, let's uh, use a really great trick right here. So let's write this 2 to the power 1 over 32 as 2 to the power 2 over 64. Okay, absolutely the same. So 2, two uh, over 64, this is the same as 1 over 32. Okay, absolutely the same. Yeah, absolutely the same as right here. But I want to write this in this way as 2 over 64. What we're going to do next? Let's go back to this property. So we can easily write this 2 over 2 to the power 2 over 64 as 2 to the power 2 times 1 over 64. And we can easily apply this rule. So we can easily bring these two in parentheses. So we can write it as, as 2 to the power, so 2 square to the power 1 over 64. Okay? Okay, so I hope you understand this step, so we can easily write it in, in this way. So what we're going to do next, let's raise 2 square, we have everyone know about it, this is equal to 4 to the power 1 over 64. Okay, it was our first, first step. What we're going to do next, let's do the same step once more. So we have, uh, I want to write this equation, so we have x to the power 1 over x. Okay, this is our equation right now, x to the power 1 over x equal to 4 to the power 1 over 64. Okay, let's do the same step once more. Let's multiply numerator and denominator by 2. So we have we have x to the power 1 over x equal to 4 to the power, not 1 over 64, but 2 over 128. Okay? And right now the same logic, the same step. So this 2 goes to another parenthesis. So we have right here, right here we have we have 4 square to the power 1 over 128, okay? 1 over 128, which gives us right here, which gives us 16 to the power 1 over 128, okay? Okay, let's go next step. Let's do the same step right here once more. So we have x to the power 1 over x equal to this 16 to the power 1 over 128. Let's do the same step once more. Let's write this 16 to the power 1 over 128. Let's write as right here. So let's let's look at this solution. So we have right here 16 to the power 2 over 256. Okay, 256. 
6. And this is really interesting moment because this 16 to the power uh, 2 over 256 is equal to 16 square to the power 1 over 256. And this is really interesting moment because 16 square equal to 256. Okay, so right here we have 256. So after all manipulation, after all simplifying steps, we have right here x to the power 1 over x equal to 256 to the power 1 over 256. Okay, so let's solve this right here on the left hand side. So we have, we have right here x to the power 1 over x equal to 256 to the power to the power 1 over 256 and it implies that our x equal to 256 because we have the same basis and the same exponent we have right here so our x is equal to 256. I hope you understand my solution. I hope you learned something new, but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. If you need help with any of these classes, I have a lot of videos on my YouTube channel. So with that being said, I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time and see you in the next videos. Have a great day.